So we're looking in the Thompson and Chain reference, the Thompson Chain reference Bible under the heading of the church, and it's we're looking right in 749 through about 755 right now because first we have to understand that church isn't even a biblical word. So once you understand that, you'll understand that the whole office of the deacon, office of the bishop, isn't even there. And we'll look at that later, looking in the interlinear Bible. But right now, we're just going to look at the word church, where it turns out no one even knows where this word comes from. The origin of the word is uncertain. And if you'd like to pause it and read some of that right there, you'll learn a little bit more about that. So right here, it goes on to say, Curiacon, the Lord's house. Well, we know that our bodies are the temple. Our bodies are the Lord's house. So, that's not even for certain where it comes from, though, as we'll see. It says, the meaning of the word would thus seem to be, in the New Testament, the whole company of God's elect. Amen. That's exactly what it is. Those whom he has called to be his people under the new dispensation, as he did the Israelites under the old. Upon this rock I will build my ecclesia. The word church isn't in the scriptures, as we saw. No one even knows where that word comes from exactly. But right here, he explained, they explain, and we're looking in the McClintock and Strong now. He explains that the word church is first applied by St. Luke to the company of original disciples at Jerusalem on the day of Pentecost. Well, he didn't say church. He said ecclesia. And as we see, it's the people, not a building. It says down here, I actually, one moment, I kind of, right here he explains that there was probably some word which in the languages from which the Teutonic and Slavic are descended designated the old heathen places of religious assembly, and this word, having taken different forms in different dialects, was adopted by the Christian missionaries. It was probably connected with the Latin circus. And that's exactly why you have the lights, the movement, the action, the whole worldly appearance, is because it's from the circus, circulus, and with the Greek kuklos, possibly also with the Welsh Clyke, Syk, Sinek, and so on and on it goes. So the circus, Circe, she transforms people into swine, as we see happens in these buildings. The whole number of those who profess the Christian religion under pastors. Okay, that's uh, some word games, but particular society of Christians in particular cities or provinces, the church in Jerusalem. But we know it's not a building, so the whole thing topples under that as we will see more of. So we're going to look at the word ecclesia. This is what the scripture uses. And that's, this is where they put the word church. A calling out. Meeting, congregation, synagogue, community. The word stresses a group of people called out for a special purpose. Amen. Ecclesia from ek out in klesis, a calling to call. And we'll see how it connects to the words elect, to select, to pick out, to choose for oneself. God chooses us to follow him. And a cloge, a picking out, choosing. And these words are connected to the word for elect. Elect. We have been selected by God, are elected by God. So now we're going to look at the word claim here. I had it open. So, clamer, to call out. Shout. Claim. So right here, a sh you know, a calling out or a public crier. You'll see it say, and sometimes meeting, congregation. So, a calling out. Claim. We're claimed by God. We're elected by God. He calls us out. Claim. And so, if we look up the word, I had this open. I should have marked it. Sorry about this. But, face, fit, face or thick or face, faceio, to make or do. That's what it's from in the Latin. And we see, like, an office is a duty, role, position, or post. God elects the people who are going to serve as a function in the body. And we are the body if we believe, and we're one body, one body of Christ, all who believe. So it says, Ted was elected to the office. There you go, elected to the office or corporation vice president. Offices mean help, assistance, or favor. And we could go on here, but I'm just showing you that the word church isn't even a biblical word. <laughs> The word ecclesia is the word, and it says our bodies are the temple, not a building. So we'll look at the these roles for the offices in the next, which we'll see aren't actually in the in the scripture at all. Alright, so we see from this video church is not a biblical word.